him on I'm not even one. And I'm David Williams. Today is Thursday, April 15th, 2021. Today's weather is forecasted to have rain showers in the morning and scattered thunderstorms in the afternoon. The high will be around 74 degrees and the low will be around 50 degrees. Cougars, we wanted to tell we wanted to start today by telling you about a contest we are hosting in celebration of Earth Day, which is on April twentieth, next Tuesday. Earth Day is all about advocating for the protection of our planet, its habitats, and its ecosystems. This year's Earth Day theme is "Together We Can Restore Our Earth." In honor of the theme, we are asking you to design a T-shirt. Just draw a picture or design an illustration online that has the following three requirements. Number one, it has to say Earth Day 2021. Number two, it has to say the theme, Together We Can Restore Our Earth. And number three, it has to be your own original design. Do not copy someone else's idea and try to pass it off as your own. That's plagiarism. The deadline to submit your t-shirt design is next Friday, April 23rd. Share it with our email address at cmsnews at colleton.k12.sc.us or drop off your entry in the library. The winner's design will be featured on our show, of course, and first place will receive a $25 gift card from the 8th grade science department. Second and third place will receive a prize to be announced at a later at a later date. Remember, Cougars, today and tomorrow our teachers and staff are going to be getting their second round of the COVID vaccine. Today and tomorrow are virtual learning days, so be sure to log in to Google Classroom to complete your assignment. Don't forget to complete your work, Cougars. You don't want to be count counted as absent. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for a moment of silence. Today, CCMS, we will bring we will bring you a great new seg segment in which we tell you about interesting foods from all over the world, and then we try the food. Our first food is called mochi. Tula Hildebrand is here to tell us more about this Japanese. Food. What's up, CCMS? I'm Tula Hildebrand, and today on the news we have a new segment where we try foods from different cultures. Now, today's food is going to be mochi. Mochi is like a rice cake made with a special type of rice called mochi nome. It sometimes uses other ingredients such as water, sugar, and cornstarch. The rice is pounded into a paste and molded into the desired shape. In Japan, it is traditionally made in a ceremony called mochi eskuti. I probably said that wrong. Sorry. I probably said that wrong. So... On its own, mochi ha mochi tastes kind of like a rice, but sticky, stretchy, soft, and chewy. It has a starchy aftertaste, and it comes with many, many flavors. So, I have a piece of one right here. This is just a piece. Um, on some pieces, you can see how powdery it is. Very powdery. So that's the paste on the inside. So this is matcha green tea flavored. And I wanted to try it. <laughs> mm. That's actually pretty good. I like that. I can definitely taste the flavor. Naturally. Go ahead. Wait, you try it. What are we doing? What is that? Oh my god! It's called 
much you eat it. And it's eat nasty it. just like that too. It's, it's, it's mushy. <laughs> <laughs> It's like Japanese candy. Well, Japanese candy is slack. <laughs> You're nasty. You like it? You try it. Good morning. All right, go ahead, Aiden. Yes, eat it. It's gonna be oh, be careful with your braces. braces. Keep, be careful. I got braces too, so. It's not that It just tastes like powder. The powder is slack. It's just like flour. <laughs> You like it? It tastes like salami. It tastes like salami. And then it feels like it's like salami. 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 Fine. That's nasty. Why would you want to try that? Yeah. Tastes like a balloon. Tastes like a balloon. <laughs> <laughs> they do. I used to put them things in my mouth too. <laughs> Balloons are nasty. That's not bad. Thank you. Of course you would like not it. Bad. I don't like anything, so this is a shocker. Yeah, I'm so picky, so. Nah, that's slack. I, Ms. Bro, you shouldn't want us to eat stuff like that. That's <laughs> slack. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to eat Honestly, it just tastes like it's covered in flour. Also why would he have to do that if he had mochi before? Because he's given us his reaction. So it's it like eating cookie dough for us? Cookie so dough. Not is, it, is it like really good? So the taste of Gigi is actually good. The texture is on point. Slimy. Mochi is good. Just tastes so good. Listen here. Wow. Look at our new team being all adventurous, trying new things. Some of them don't seem to like what they've tried, but at least they've tried. What new foods have you tried lately? Send us your funny videos of you trying new foods at cmsnews at colleton.k12.sc.us. Speaking of funny videos, we have some great new videos to share with you. Check out these furry and not so furry friends of CCMS. Hey, what's up, CCMS? This is my cutest animal. Her name is Pickles, and this is Dwight Sweat. Out. Okay, can I get out? Can I get out? I don't got nothing for you. Th thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh, and you're back. And you're back. Excuse me, sir. 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 You know what? See, that's that's why when people come to the house, they think you're trying to leave with them all the time. Because you don't know how to get out the car. Let me get out. Well, that's all for our show today. Have a great day, Cougars. And don't forget to log on tomorrow. What's up, CCMS? What's up, CCMS? <laughs>